guys, good morning. This is my fourth day of school. My third day of school was the worst. <laughs> I did not know. It was the worst? Why is it the worst? I have to do a lap. Did you do a lap yesterday? No. But you saved me, remember? I saved you because I picked you up early. See, that was actually a good thing. And you said that it was a bad thing that I picked you up early. <laughs> Look at that, I saved you from having to do laps. Why do you have to do laps? Because my class was so loud. Mm -hmm. And I was the, clou the quietest, quietest one. one. So I was sorry. like, <laughs> just sitting in my chair. <laughs> so. But I got three panda books. That's good. You just keep being a good girl and you get the rewards, okay? The other kids could be knuckleheads sometimes. Um, so I have the a first day of school when we were in Miss 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 Santiago, we were doing so so. And what happened yesterday? They just was. They got crazy on it, huh? They had the in the in the after day. We were having guests coming. Ooh, so and, cool. Yeah. Mm. And and we have to pack up our our backpack, and some of them are just sit, talking to their friends. And they're not paying attention to the teacher. Yeah, they're just going like, "Hi, what are you doing?" Oh my God, I'm so sorry, but we can Well, like I said, you do what you're supposed to do when your teacher will speak at. And you just make sure that you always stay in good behavior. Not like the other good looks. And okay. also when I was the when I was the um when there was a okay, substitute in Miss in Miss Santiago's class and then Miss Santiago came. Okay. Wow. Why am someone like this well, I'm saying Miss Santiago? <laughs> Alright, give these a code for me. Like this. I give them the crust. Yeah. Don't like to waste food in the house, so yeah. we give them to the dog. Do you want to see it? Hi guys! I look crazy. Do you want to They can see him. He's Just drop the rest. He is one year old. Oh, okay. Actually, he should be. He'll be going on. He'll be going on two. Drop it, baby. He's look, waiting for you. There we go. <laughs> so today I have a doctor's appointment. So I'm gonna drop her off at the bus stop and then head that way um last night was not a good night for me um i put a tina to sleep and i was getting ready to go wash my hair just like normal like whatever and when i went to separate like um i wash my hair in sections so it's not a lot so when i went to let me step back so when i went to separate my hair because my hair is always curly or whatever. Literally, my scalp was flaky, and I, when I literally like went like this to separate my hair, it cracked, and like my my scalp it wasn't bleeding, but it was red and it was raw, and like I was like I went to do another section, and it was the same thing, and I was just like, what the heck is happening to my head? And it's crazy because it is an itch. It's not like irritating. However, it's super dry and I spent literally an hour scrubbing my head with Selsun Blue last night and then Honey went to, he went out to CVS and he got me some tea tree oil, but I can't use tea tree oil until the abrasions, I guess, that are inside my head, until they're um, healed, I guess. This says don't put, tea, don't, do not put tea tree oil on anything that's like, 
anything that has been bleeding or like has an abrasion or whatnot and like my scalp is raw from me scratching all that build up off my head and I'm like where the heck does this come from and of course I google it and it's all normal their trimester pregnancy is normal so has anybody ever experienced severe dry scalp severe dry flaky scalp in their third trimester please help your girl out please let me know what you did what I have in my hair right now is coconut oil and I'm hoping that it leaves it remember my appointment talk to my doctor ask him what to do if not, I'm gonna make an appointment with dermatologist because I've never in my life have had dandruff like that last night. That was scary. I thought I was gonna have to shave my head because of how much it was. And like, I literally had to, I washed my hair like this. I had the thousand blue at my fingertips and I would go, I was in the mirror and I would go section by section, just like, just scrap, scrap, scrap. Section by section, scrape, scrape, scrape. Section by section, scrape, scrape, scrape. And that's exactly what I did. And that took me almost an hour and then I rinsed it out. Babe helped me rinse it out because it was hurting so bad, like stinging my scalp. <sighs> but yeah, I don't want this vlog to be super, super long. So yeah, I'm going to go to the doctors and then we'll see what else we do today. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm back. <laughs> Hi guys, so Atina did. You tell me, you tell me, you tell me. Tell my me. horse, my horse lesson. You did horseback riding lesson. Yeah. I did so good, but my the first two, I was a little bit scared. Let me show you how it was. Like, before I was like this, uh -huh. I was like this. I was like this. Mm -hmm. Then I was doing some walks, and uh -huh. then it got a little bit faster, uh -huh. and then my tummy felt weird. You thought you felt weird? Yeah, <laughs> he was like, oh, I'm going to throw up. <laughs> but how did you like walking the horse? Oh, that was really fun. When you leaded it? Yeah. What was, was your horse's little... name again? The horse was named it was called Summer Summer Star? Storm. Summer Summer Storm. Yeah. Nice. And we're gonna insert some video clips that my dad sent as mm -hmm. well. She was more like a snack person. The horse? Yeah. So whenever, did you give what, sugar cubes or no, carrots? No, we didn't give her any sugar cubes. We didn't give her anything. When we were walking in, in, into the um to the um grooming area, uh -huh. <laughs> the horse was like, there's like, there's like a weird kind of thing of of hay and she was like, mm, hey. Oh, she was like, And hey. I was like, come on. Oh, <laughs> horsey. So you liked your horse back riding lesson. Yeah. You want to keep going. Yeah. You found your thing. You found your thing. Yeah. Boom. All right. Guess what you gotta do now? Yeah. Gotta take a bath. Yeah. And get ready for bed. I almost. And heard guess it. What? what? Your bed is ready in your own room. <laughs> the AC is fit. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want this. <laughs> it's been a fun having sleepover parties with you every single night, but <laughs> it's time to go back in your own bed. <laughs>